Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. So every morning, you're gonna walk up this hill right here. Beautiful walk, feels great on your thighs. You're gonna walk up this hill right here, get on your way over to campus. It's like a three, four minute walk, not too bad at all. Behind me, we have the large animal facility. So over there, we've got the horses, sheep, donkey. Upper auditorium, which has an upper section. And then if you go around the back, there's a lower section. We're gonna go on the side here. Seating right here in case you're feeling cute that day. We've got bathrooms on each side, boys, girls. And then this is the auditorium. There's people in here, so we're just gonna get right back on out. Coming around the side of the upper auditorium. Get go. So we've got a couple options for on-campus dining. We've got Paw Paw, Banditos, Spice Shack, Ooh, what was the other one? Papa, a lot of vegan options, also all natural, recycled products. So I'm talking like wooden forks and knives, spoons. We've got a lot of healthy options, soup, salad, spice shack right here, which is like Indian style cuisine. So you've got like your chicken marsala, but we've also got like chicken fingers, mac and cheese. Other eating area over here, burger shack right here. Then we have smoothies and then boba tea back there. Got some fries. <laughs> so we just walked from the food court area and we're coming around the back side of campus. Make your way down this slippery slope. Oh, sh <laughs> So we just walked off the side of the road of Ross, came all the way down here, and then we end up coming out right here. And this is so nice down here. This building was just built, I think, in the past year, so it's really nice inside. Ready for this? Whew. Did you just feel like a doctor walking in here? My favorite part about this building is how new the bathrooms are. Look at this. Beautiful, beautiful new bathrooms. If you have to go to the bathroom, it's like a number two situation, you're gonna wanna go in here. The pathology building. Pathology building, don't forget about her. Don't forget her. about her. Yeah, she's cute. Um, what is it? It's a veggie sandwich, it got pesto, cheese in there and stuff, but it actually tastes good. These hills, find out who. Find out who, <laughs> and I will find you. the library. I thought I would never be there, and yet I am like neighborhood watch there. So <laughs> behind me right here, we've got the dog kennels. And then right next to the Clinical Skills Lab, we have Yvonne, and she comes every day with three different home-cooked meals, and they are so good. It's a good price, good portion, she'll leave a meal prep for you. Clinical Skills Lab, this is basically where you learn how to be a doctor. It's open. All right, no one's in here. You're practicing all your clinical skills, so we have models right here. Common skills down that you're gonna need to know when you're a doctor, and then after a few semesters, they're gonna test you on these skills to make sure you actually know what you're doing. Okay, so we were at the Clinical Skills Lab, we walked around the back, and then right here, is where all your professors are gonna be. So if you need to go to their office, you need to ask a question, right here, okay? I'm emphasizing this because I had no idea where this was. Faculty office, mango tree, mango tree, faculty office, you're welcome. Faculty services. No. Nope. Read it. Oh. <laughs> faculty offices. And then over there, we've got lab services, but I have no idea what that building is for. I'll probably figure it out in a few semesters, but just so you know. Right back over here, we have the Ross Veterinary Clinic. And then just these buildings over here. Oh my God, look how big that lizard is. Oh my God. So now we're at the aviary. So yeah, if you... Ah! Ah! Okay. So this general area has a whole strip of important things that you will probably spend a lot of time at. So there's IT right here, all the way down. This dark hallway is the nurse's office. This side, we've got financial aid, which I literally spend maybe once a week there for a few hours. You're gonna be so grateful for the people that we have in financial aid. Anatomy lab. Library. So when you first enter the library, you got some printers right here, and then this is the exam center. <laughs>
quick little detour on our campus tour. We have the toxic plant garden. A professor here planted all the plants here. All these plants are toxic, not to us, but to animals. Study spaces. <laughs> And these stairs lead up to the back of the anatomy lab. So this is where the anatomy museum is. Take a little peek inside. You don't need scrubs to be in here, which is nice. Woo, hot out. We're at the academic hub. Lots of places to study here. Oh, this place too? Nice bathrooms. You're gonna thank me for knowing where all the nice bathrooms are. Study room. Study room. Study room with no person in it. Look at these study rooms. This is a nice study room. You got a whiteboard, you can connect your iPad, iPhone, Mac, it's the Apple TV, and you can spy on people. So we basically just did like a big lap around. So we just came from over here, did a big circle, and now we're here. So we're walking over to the student union. We got the food right back down here. Center of campus, student union right here. We got a vending sign with no vending machines, but we're actually about to get five vending machines on campus, which is pretty nice. Got some outdoor study spaces right here. And something I really like about these outdoor study spaces is not only are they shaded, have tables, but there's also outlets right outside on the grass for you to use, which is nice. Upstairs, union, that's where the classrooms are. We'll get to that. No scrubs. Gym. I'm not gonna record in the gym because people are working out and it's kind of weird. But gym is kind of small, but it's got stuff that you need. They've got weights, um, some working treadmills. All the stuff is, for the most part, donated to the school, but I mean, it works. When you go up the stairs from the union, you come up here. You're gonna come up to the back of the classroom two and classroom one. A lot of seats. They've got three projector screens, which are really nice, so it doesn't really matter where you're sitting. You're gonna see everything. All right, so we're gonna go actually inside Union now. Inside Union, we have our own little coffee shop called Rituals. There's some couches, tables in there to study and socialize, and there's also three big fridges, which is really nice because you can store all your food for the week in there, and then we've also got microwaves and toaster ovens in there. On-campus ATM, sometimes it steals your car. I've never had any problems. I have Bank of America. I'm gonna pump out EC. I you don't even gotta put that on there. You ain't gotta put that on. Y'all just need to know that. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't put that in there. Don't put uh, that in there. I don't think I'm gonna put that in there. <laughs> For best bathrooms on here, really? I'm gonna say Pathology Building. Yo! Oh, yeah. Don't forget about <laughs> This parking lot right here, seventh semester and staff only. If you park up here and you don't have a badge to park up here, I'm not even kidding, they will box your car in and park around you so you cannot get out. If you're not one of those two, you're gonna have to park all the way down there, but it's only like a four minute walk up here. It's not that bad.